I didn't really know anything about origami. I, I knew what I knew from seeing final products. I mean, like I had seen what people had made. And I think my son, when he was really young, was really kind of into origami. So that was really all I kind of knew about it, is just seeing what other people had done. And I always thought to myself, how on earth did they make that? How did they make that flower? Or how did they make that turtle or the frog or, or whatever? So it, I've been intrigued by it for years. And I guess it was just finally time to learn how to do it. I'm really proud of it. I mean, it actually looks like a dinosaur. I mean, that, that's the, the really cool thing at the end. I mean, trust me, I had my doubts as I was going through the process of it. I'm like, how on earth is this green piece of paper going to end up like a dinosaur? But in the end, voila, I have a dinosaur. Uh, since I was following, since it was my first time and I was following some step-by-step -step instructions, I really do think that my dinosaur looks just like everybody else's. So I don't really feel like I got to be creative in this, but because uh, it just looks just like it was supposed to. But I had to learn the skills. I, I didn't realize that it was all about how the folds go together and how to take something square, make it look like something like this. So, so I guess the skill set was really great, but I don't feel like mine is any different than anybody else's right now. But in the future, I would like to, to learn new ways and new techniques and maybe come up with my own uh, shapes and designs. Oh, I would change the size of paper that I used. Uh, I would... I would do it much bigger for my first one because as I was getting near the end and those folds were getting so tiny that with that paper, it was kind of getting hard to do them. Now, I know I've seen some people make origami, the same origami shape on very small pieces of paper. But again, since this was my first one, I would have done it different and started with a bigger piece of paper and it maybe would have been a lot easier that way. But that's just me. Well, here it is. I would like to present to you my origami green dinosaur. Here it is in all of its beauty. Enjoy. Take it in. If you would like any of these made for you, just contact me. You know, $20, I can make you one. A little side hustle going on there, supporting my teaching career. But anyhow, there it is, and I hope you enjoyed it.